YouTube medics, what up? You can tell I'm ready for Movember. Can't do no shave November because I got to make sure that uh, the HEPA mask and the uh, N95s fit my face. But uh, obviously, I'm not at work today. I'm out driving around in my own truck, and uh, I'm thinking about work. Um, the big thing today that I want to talk about is system status management. This is something that we're discussing right now in our organization. We are using system status, and I want to find out from you, do you guys use zone? Do you use deployment? Do you use system status? And then I want to find out, do you like it? What works and what doesn't work? The reason we're having this discussion right now is because our system status primarily is based on geography, and it's creating one little snafu, and that is that the busiest section of town uh, is not covered very well through the system status management. In other words, they place a vehicle at a standby point, and then when the busy section of town gets a call, they move the, the truck at the standby point up to cover that zone. Well, basically that's shutting the gate after the horse is out. And so it's very reactive. And what we're looking at is a, a proactive approach to fixing this particular problem. So I kind of have an unpopular opinion as far as medics and EMTs go on system status because I like it. It, it works. Um, but in each system, there's going to be little nuances that have to be adjusted. And in our particular case, uh, the standby point that, that is uh, geographically correct, volume, call volume wise, is not correct. Um, so we're addressing that. So here's what I want you to do. Leave me a comment, email me your video. I'll make sure it gets published. Um, and let me know what you think about system status, whether it does work, whether it doesn't work, um, whether you like it, whether you don't like it. And then I want to know, do you guys work eight hour shifts, 12 hour shifts, 16 or 24 hour shifts? Um, and how does that affect the system status? I'm on a 24 hour truck. We do have 12 hour trucks in our system as well. Um, so for us, you know, all in all, it works out well. But uh, I want you guys to participate. This channel's for you. Uh, if you want to email me, it's medicjud, M-E-D-I-C-J-U-D-D, -D -D, at gmail.com. Post comments, send videos, share the page. Love you guys. Bye. Be safe.